international students, losing thousands of dollars. In today's video update, we will be talking about students losing thousands of dollars after Australia suspends border reopening. International students have expressed the financial difficulty they are facing because of Australia's decision to suspend the reopening of its borders. In the past the Federal Government of Australia stated that Australia's borders would open for vaccinated students on the 1st of December 2021, allowing them what stakeholders mention as a clear pathway to arriving on Australian shores. Sadly, the Australian government has now stated that it will suspend the reopening of the Australian border until the 15th of December 2021, so they can put together more information on the Omicron variant. Presently, international students who had reserved their flights and lodging have stated that they have lost huge amounts of money due to the delay. But in a recent statement, the government of Australia stated that the decision to pause the reopening of the borders was made on the foundation of medical advice given by the Chief Medical Officer of Australia, Paul Kelly. The statement further stated that the National Security Committee has taken the obligatory and temporary decision to suspend the next step to safely reopen Australia to international skilled and student associates, in addition to humanitarian, working holiday maker and provisional family visa holders from the 1st of December until the 15th of December 2021. The temporary suspension will make sure Australia can gather the information we require to better understand the Omicron variant, including the effectiveness of the vaccine, the range of illness, including if it may create more mild symptoms, and the level of diffusion. A representative from the Government of Australia Department of Education, Skills and Employment mentioned. After the Australia's Chief Medical Officer advice, the Government of Australia has taken the necessary decision to suspend the next step to securely reopen Australia until the 15th of December 2021. We are cautious that some students had in the past made arrangements to come to Australia and may be heavily impacted by this suspension. The Australian government settings and strategies are still in place to support the return of international students, skilled migrants and other cohorts, and we plan to welcome them back to Australia very soon. The Government of Australia is hopeful that all education and training providers to carry on supporting international students offshore through increasing options for online studies, bearing in mind the fee waivers or reductions, along with ongoing student support services, including mental health support and counselling services. Please keep in mind that counselling and mental health support is accessible to international students located in Australia through their education provider and via services, backed by the Australian government and community organisations. This is the end of today's video update. Please don't forget to hit the like button and comment below to share your opinion. Thanks for watching today's update.